Hello everybody, hey Paper Mario Sunshine here, back with some more Super Paper Mario. In the last episode, we finished up Chapter 6, and abruptly came to an end after the end of the world. Samus' kingdom is no more, it's just a white void. We also had fought Mr. L as well, who also met his own terrible fate. And, now we go see what we can do about the pure heart that has turned into a rock, of sorts. Let's see if we could, what we can do to fix it. Oh-ho! The heroes return! Tell me, do you have the seventh pure heart? Well, maybe you should take a, a look at it, Merlin. Hmm. Hmm. What, what happened to it? The void had consumed that world and left the pure heart like this. Hmm. Do not feel the typical energy from this pure heart. Even if you set it in a heart pillar, it would do nothing. What to do? Oh. But then, how do we save him? I mean, how do we save everyone from destruction? To stop this prophecy, we must defeat Count Blake, who started all this. But to do that, we will need all eight pure hearts, as the light prognosticus says. We are between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> a forlorn group of heroes. How they cry. The tears flow like sad chowder. Dementio, what are you doing here? Oh, bad news for you. There is no way in this world to restore the pure heart. Yes, sadly, your hard work was all in vain. Er? Are you serious? That really stinks. <laughs> yes, it does. And that that's why I decided to give you a consolation prize. Mario? Princess Peach! Bowser! Mario! Where did you go? Mario! It's quite simple. I fulfilled their wishes. I sent them to the next world. <laughs> you do know who I am, right? I am your enemy, Dementio. I serve Count Leck. Well, as pleasant as this it has been, I must leave. Ciao! It can't be... Mario... No! Well, hi! Hey, new face! So tell me, first time down here in the underwear? Huh? Just a little joke. People don't have here... Don't, don't arrive here twice. Ha 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 ha! Huh? What do you say? What's the underwear? You're kidding, right? Man, for a guy with no extra lives, you're sure you're sure hilarious, isn't it? Obvious? This is where people go when their games are over. We call it World One Neg World Negative One. So how did your game end? Anyway, poison one up, bad jump, or did someone? What? You said your game's not over? Ha ha ha! Yeah, I've heard that before. Denial, always the first step, and you should, you just need to hear it from Queen Jadies. She's the scariest in the underwear, and that is saying something. She rules over us Jadies, and she'll tell you straight, and she'll tell you straight, your game is over. So we're in the underwear, and uh, it's basically hell. Hey, how's your after game? Listen, if you feel tired, take a dip in the fountain. That'll power you right up. Of course, if you're already feeling fine, there's probably no point in going for a swim. So yeah, this heals you up if you were low on HP. So yeah, Mario's dead. Mario, Peach, and Bowser are all dead. Yeah, just when our hero's journeys just went from bad to worse. Boy, if that Micro Goomba hadn't dashed out just as I jumped for that platform... Oh, you swerved in midair, landed on a spiked floor, and ended your game, huh? What? No! What kind of jumper do you think I am? I clear spikes so easy. Then BAM! Bottomless pit! Oh boy, I can tell you're new here. Let me do you a favor and tell you what's up. The river Twigs is up ahead. Okay, be really careful not to drown. 
Word is there are ghosts down there that drag you down and never to surface again. Huh? What happens if she if to shadies that fall in? Well, they're after game ends. I figure they end up in the post after game or something. Oh, uh, I just love all like the humor that they have. Just like discussing like games and like them doing like Mario platformers and uh yeah, this is being called the negative one world is a reference to the minus world in Super Mario Bros. A glitched world that you could uh, go into. It's uh, a pretty clever thing that I would never thought they would do. Dooby dooby doo. Oh me, I wonder if I shall meet my most special someone this day. Surely he's a prince of countenance fair, pining even now to meet me. Quickly, my loving prince, fly to me! Pray, what call hast thou to stare at me so? Didst thou hear me pine for an old mustachioed fatty? Be gone! Whoa! Okay, I was not expecting that. Unfortunately, we don't really have anything else, so... Uh, we don't really have any of our uh, friends, so I guess we go on ahead. We have no way to get rid of any of these dry bones. Hmm. Got some embers here as well. What it seems. some pipes in the background too, but we can't quite make it. Alright. Seems we got a shroom shake here to get though. Nice. So yeah, uh Oh. This is the river twigs. Its waters are the tears of centuries of sinners. Cost you four coins. I will ferry you to the other side. Thanks. Now we depart. Yeah, these are the ghost hands they're talking about if you go decide to hop into River Twigs. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very, very creepy song. It's honestly probably the scariest and most ominous Mario song ever, honestly. Like, it literally sounds like you're in hell. You're, like, being tormented. It's pretty, like, scary, honestly. Anyways? Hi, how, how are ya? Good great, I'm the man, Prime, go get her, and faithful queen servant. You wanna see the queen? You gotta move, kid, okay? She's real busy. Oh, and here's a tip. She knows all the bad stuff you did before your game ended. 
you don't play that whole I'm a hero stuff down here. Just warning you, kid. Ah, so busy. Blah, blah, blah. It's just like work in my mouth. I'm choking on it. I swear I'm so busy I don't have time to think, much less to eat or sleep. Blah. Hey, so if you lived a good life, you can move to the over there. I hear it's nice. I've got to say, I get a virtuous vibe off of you. I'm sure you'll make it there. You ought to speak to Queen Jadies right away. So yeah, there's a bunch of like demons in one. So yeah, this this definitely shows you're in hell. Shoot, I'm on dredge part patrol. The river river twigs tomorrow. That river river bed is huge too. What a pain, but it's gotta get done. Shadies gets stuck in the hole down there. Here she is herself. You, what business have you with me? I am Queen Jadies, mistress of the underwear, ruler of those who with ended games. Here in this place, your sins from your time among the living are weighed. If your sins are light enough, the bliss of the over there will be yours. But if not, you're suffer for eternity among the game over. Now let us away your sins. Hmm. I sense a strange energy. Have you brought something strange into the underwear by chance? What is this? No. No, it could not be. But how? It is badly damaged, yes. But what you hold is a pure heart. Who exactly are you to have a pure heart? What has happened to it? Oh, wait. That is my phone. Sorry, I have to take this. What is it now, Grams? You know, wh I am working. What? Lumpy's missing! Oh, mercy, I understand. Yes, yes, I will see it to... I'll see to it. Mm, bye. Just great. Just what I need. I already... I'm er I am already short-handed. What am I going to do? Oh, perhaps you can help. That phone call I received just now? That it was from the king of the over there, Granby. One of the Nimbies vanished from the over there, and he asked me to look for her. But I cannot abandon my duties here in the place, right in the palace, and my demon are all busy. You so it must fall to you. Will you search for this missing person in my palace? Right in my place? Oh, thank you so very much. I apologize for asking this of you, but it would really help. The name of this missing Nimby is Loveby. Oh, and by the way, what is your name? Mario. Well, Mario, may I hold on the, this pure heart while you are search, busy searching? Worry not. I just want a look. I will return it when you return with love me. And in its place, allow me to give you this. You got a door key. Word has reached me that someone has fallen into the river twigs. Someone s some said it was a strange fellow dressed in green. That could not be lovely. But still, in case, I would suggest that you check there first. This key will open a door in the underground waterways beneath the river twigs. Please, I must ask you to search that area thoroughly. Alright, here we go. We must find a man in green, and we must go back to the dreaded river twigs. So, let's take a dive once again. Oh boy. Oh, this is just... Oh, this is like so... So demented. Anyways, here we are at the bottom of the River Twigs. Finally, I was like, kept pressing left and it just wouldn't let me in. He even starts off like the Minus World, which is pretty hilarious. Flush everything down.
Oh, it's one of those puzzles, huh? Alright, just filling up the water again. Yeah, uh... It's definitely got a lot of video game references, well, Mario, old Mario references, surprisingly, in this chapter. Uh, it also does give us, like, a huge theme that we've never really seen in Mario, and that is death. Like, what happens after Mario games o game overs. Apparently, this is what happens. Mario, where were your extra one-ups? Oh my god, more of these guys. Uh, I wish we actually had Tippy with us, because I do want to know their names, but we'll probably, hopefully, see what they are. Maybe I can search it up afterwards. And the composers for this game really knew how to make an unsettling song. Uh, okay. Oh, that explains a lot. Something there, I think we might need a break. Uh, yeah, it's definitely a big maze, and this is a... Demenkio did say that this was our next world, and yeah, he's kind of right. Now, there is no sign of Peach or Bowser. They're not in our party, as you can see. And obviously no pixels either. Wow, well, okay. I don't know how I didn't notice that earlier. There we go. So, uh, yeah, how have you guys been? And uh, definitely let me know your thoughts on this chapter, because it's absolutely, like, a huge crazy endgame portion of the game we're going to go through. Right, go here. Got a pipe and a door. Let's go through the pipe first. Let's see if we delve deeper. At least familiar music for once. There we go. Just a bunch of coins, so it'll be pretty useful. You can find a, a store in the future. Jump down here, and a bunch of these fountains. Although they're not healing us here, I guess that that's a different fountain. Like, I see. Uh, oh boy, how did I end up in this, this stinky place? Complex underlings grab me, and then I remember that, and then, and then, oh, oh, forget it. I just, just wish somebody would help. Come and help me. Whoa! Bro? Oh yeah, I missed you, bro. What? Huh? Why am I here? Well, I don't really know. I mean, where am I exactly? What? The Underwear? The Land of Ended Games? Bro, what are you saying? What does this all mean? Aha, uh -huh, okay. I gotcha. So my game is over. Great. I guess one of Count Black's baddies must have done me in. Just like you guys, huh? Well, everybody runs out of extra life sometime, right? So what should we do now? Lovebee? We're looking for someone named Lovebee. Hey, sounds good to me. I've loaded with free time, so after all, my game's over. Luigi has joined your group! As Luigi pressed and hold down and released to soar upward with a super jump. The super jump is perfect for reaching high ledges or attacking enemies above you. I was pre feeling pretty low, bro, but now that you're here, I want to jump for joy. This looks like a job for Luigi! 
So yeah, we got the Green Thunder himself, and yeah, this is uh, taken straight from Thousand Year Door as the Ultra Boots. But yeah, Luigi's got his traction going like crazy. He has a massive jump, best in the game. And he also has the Super Jump, which is incredibly broken. It's one of the best abilities in the game, so yeah, it's uh, able to help us get back here. So yeah, finally, our fourth character is here, and it is Luigi. And you know, it's kind of already hinted at earlier with, uh... With, uh, Luigi being playable in that one section. So yeah, Luigi. It's really good to finally play as him. Uh... Yeah, it's uh, again. It's been a, like everybody's always wanted to like have Paper Luigi and the Marvelous Compass. But we never really got that. Now we could actually at least play with, as Luigi. And that's actually something some people have been hoping for in the uh, Thousand Year Door remake is that we get Paper Luigi and the Marvelous Compass. Like people have been like asking for it a lot, and I kind of hope it happens. But I feel like that's too a, too good to be true kind of thing. But it would be awesome if it did happen. Like, who would not want that? We might as well get our way out of the River Twigs. And we did see someone by that description. That, uh, matches Love Bee. Sink or swim, Luigi! Alright, thankfully, no more River Twigs for us. I just like how he says, ow, every time he does it. Okay, oh. Now we can actually go over these things. Oh boy, I, oh my god, those embers do a lot of damage. Okay, got one more platform to jump. Oh, wait. Okay, we can go in here. Whoa! There we go, gives us a little bit of like a tutorial of sorts for Luigi. So yeah, we have our fourth hero now, and uh, Luigi honestly is probably the most fun hero to play as. And yeah, you could also just obliterate any chomps that come out, too. Oh, what? Their corpses hurt us? Yeah, and you could just obliterate piranha plants, too. I did not see that, honestly. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! A peachy peach! Okay, that's actually a really good cooking item. That we have uh, yet to get. Just keep obliterating all these guys. Uh, I hope everybody's doing well. Uh, almost Christmas, and uh, I did upload uh, quite a few things as I was uh, as I usually do. I uh, hope you guys did enjoy the Dimitri video that came out just a few days ago. Uh, it was really enjoyable to like make that. And I hope to maybe do that with more heroes in the future that I really like. And, uh, hopefully, uh, I can do more of that content as well. Okay. okay, I think this might bring us to the background. Yes, it does. Can we actually do this in the background? Oh my god, we can. That's actually pretty funny. Okay, so it could bring us from one floor to the other. Okay, that makes sense. Just like a quick shortcut. Alright, let's go through that door. I think we're probably going to end off in just a bit. Let's 
you want to see what's in here if it's just a random pipe? Yeah, it's just a random pipe. Okay. Dooby dooby doo. Seems like we found who we're looking for. Also, I like how this gives you an extra jump, so it's like even more height. And all these uh, ice piranha plants are just feeling a wrap. Oh, hurry, hasten to me, sweet prince. Full, full of foulness, an ancient man of mustache grin returneth. Talk to me, talk not to me, as though we have met. Speak now, what dost thou want of me? Thou come hither to find me? Pa! As if I would consort with a face so be hairy. I await a handsome prince. Oh, oh, understand? Princes only! Oh, but hold on a moment. Aha! Dost thou claim to be a prince for whom I pine? Priceless, ye verily. Very well then, good prince, let us confirm thy lineage. If thou art my prince, then surely thou knowest my name. Speak it to my ears. If the name is true, then I shall admit thou art mine, one and only. Suck love thee. Ha ha! In thy face! My name is not love. What? How hast thou come by the knowledge of my name? No, doth this mean? Nay, nay! Such foulness! This very thought cannot be abided. I cannot date a man so old and unpleasant to that I I shall return to mother. Gag! Alright, so we found uh, Luffy and she is returning to mother, apparently. So, yeah. Next time on Super Paper Mario, we will return to uh, JD's herself. Knowing that love beast back. So we'll 